Bitcoin, the decisive moment. You want to know the last information about the crypto world? Smash the like button. It's time for crypto news with Rodrigo Arnedo. Crypto to the max. Today, so happy sharing with you again this meme for the crypto summers when Bitcoin goes crazy up and we are all enjoying and having so much fun. Are you having fun or are you sad today? Well, I have some news for you if you're sad. Uh, we have this rumor out there. Remember, this is a rumor. This might be fake news. That's why it's not in the thumbnail nor in the title of the video. But this a circulating rumor that maybe Jeff Bezos, one of the richest men in the world, uh, just bought Bitcoin, sold Amazon stock. That's for reals, allegedly. And uh, now he bought some uh, Bitcoin. Maybe... Now millionaires and billionaires are also buying, uh, not just the institutions with those ETFs. If so, you can imagine all these millionaires fighting for having more and more Bitcoin that could bring Bitcoin price to the moon and beyond. And I have more good news. Like, for example, this one. Wells Fargo and Bank of America's Merrill are offering spot Bitcoin ETFs to wealth clients. In Brazil, BlackRock's spot Bitcoin ETF is going to start trading tomorrow, today. And also good uh, for this giant vanguard. We had the CEO. He said, while I'm here, Bitcoin is not going to happen. The ETFs of Bitcoin are not going to happen in our company. Well, he's no longer the CEO. So maybe vanguard is going also to change its policies. And we have to tell you today about why March is going to change everything. Very decisive month for Bitcoin. And let's talk about how we close February 2024. You can see we closed it in the 61,161 approximately. And that means this is the third best month of Bitcoin's history. If we go to the week, uh, is the fourth in all-time high terms. And right now, we are going higher. That's good. So let's see the situation for February right now. It's 10 times in the green for Bitcoin's history and just three times in the red. February, one of the best months for Bitcoin performance. You can see also that the last four Februarys, we are in the green. And this February was the second best best for Bitcoin history. You can also notice that we have six weeks in the green. Just two times in the past, we had this situation here and here. And maybe I have not so many good news about this today because after the six and after the six, we went down a little bit or a lot as you consider. So maybe we are up for a rest right now. Bitcoin needs to go down a little bit or it's going to make history so decisive month. Maybe we have seven months in a row on the green. This time is different. Maybe so. Consider that I still believe and I'm not expert. I have no idea whatsoever what's going to happen with Bitcoin price. But I believe we are following this uh, bull run. And if that's so, you can see February was in the green, but March was in the red. So maybe a little breather out there. We'll see about that here with CoinGlass. Uh, you have those percentages. I'm going to leave you the link in the description below in case uh, you want to do your own research. And you can see that we have the second best, best February, 43%. We had a 61% in 2013. And we were okay with a 20%. And as we are comparing the situation right now with 2016, in my opinion, well, I expect maybe a correction of a little bit for March or maybe a small growth on March. But we'll see about that because this time might be so different. We see here all this March uh, for Bitcoin five times in the green, seven times in the red for Bitcoin's history. You can see that the last three years we had a March in the green. So if we compare the situation with February's, this time March might be in the green too. But also, again, if we go to this moment in time in 2017 or even 2016, the two moments we compare the situation with, 
uh, you can see that we had red months of March, a little breather. What do you think about this? Leave a comment below. Thank you very much for your opinion. Are we up for this 5%, maybe 9% down, or uh, we are going to go crazy high? What do you think about that? Remember that we uh, are 50 days approximately to the halving event. And allegedly, as we studied it, uh, we are in maybe uh, still for that uh, by the rumor, sell the news. But if we go deeply into the chart, you can see that the last time uh, we keep on going up at this point with 49 days to the halving. Also, in the second and first time we had this situation, you can see we went up and some weeks before we started going down, but we still have four more weeks maybe going up. And if we go to the first time, well, at this point, we should go down and then start going up again. So we'll see the uh, similarities in the future for Bitcoin. We can't predict the future, but we study it a lot. Remember, we told you, Bitcoin uh, is uh, stronger than gold. And also we told you everything about this halving event here in this video. Do not miss that. If you want more information about the halving. And also in this video, we told you that Bitcoin uh, probably was going to do something never did in the past. And it did actually do it. What is that? Well, we close a monthly uh, just uh, beyond and so beyond the close from the last two years. And when this happens, we told you we go crazy up. And this always happens uh, after the halving. You can see it here and here. But this time it happened before the halving. So this time is different, more violent, this rise. Go to the video if you want to know more about that or maybe even about this line that is also a record that Bitcoin broke it the eight degree line broke it before and not after as in the last two cycles. So again, maybe we are up for something different. We broke the Fibonacci 6.18. We are making records every day with Bitcoin and you need to consider what's going to happen right now. What do you think about it? We have here the RSI indicator and uh, now I'm using this line in the 91. Maybe you want to take some profits. Well, uh, if you want to be sure, this was uh, the last time top and the uh, last times, uh, previous times were higher. So if you want to be sure, maybe 90, 90 would be your point of selling. We'll see about that. But also consider that if you sell there, you might miss all this rise we had here, or even you might miss all this high we had here, all this rise, all this pump. So who knows? Any case, it's lovely to see that from this point, we still might have a lot of months going up. I will take profit this time, I promise. Will you? We'll see about that. And also another good advice comes from Jack Canfield. He tells us here that the idea is not to go in and out, in and out. Be careful with the speculation. Be careful with trading. Because I tried that in 2016, 2017, and it was not okay. That's why we just buy and hold for a long time. Remember this chart. We are on track with this bull run. We are stronger than ever. Maybe we'll be in April 2025 in the 1 million. That would be awesome to see. We are going stronger. If we go to the daily, you can compare this point with this one. And we are earlier. It seems we are doing things earlier. And today, another crazy chart with your friend here, Rodrigo Ornado, Crypto to the Max in Crypto News. The idea that we are doing the same thing that we did from January 2023. Right now, if we keep on going with this chart, you can see that we are doing the same again. And if that's so, we might go down now to $50,000 and then recover. And we might be in this uh, maybe $1,2700 uh, for uh, March 2025. So another uh, not so strong prediction, but a good one. And also we use this chart in the past and I want to use it a little bit more. Remember, we talked about how we broke this moving average and the price action is the same. So what now? 
Well, we went up 33%. We went up now more than 33%. And from that point, we went down 18%. So maybe we go down 18%. That would be the $50,000. So a lot of information coming to tell us that maybe $50,000 is the retest that we need to make. We'll see about that in next video. So watch them all. Remember right now, the crypto market cap is far beyond $2 trillion And we topped at $3 trillion in the past. So we still have room. And maybe the thing is, as Tony Tapata is telling us here, that we are following the path of gold. If that's so, he believes with these calculations, you can stop the video and uh, read it, that Bitcoin price might be in uh, 725,000 euros per one Bitcoin. That could be the top. And it's not just something that some writers believe. Scaramucci in this video told us that he believes that uh, gold is a $6 trillion asset and Bitcoin may be better. We told you it's better. Uh, we believe that. So if we go to that market cap with Bitcoin, well, you can picture how we can go to those $200,000 range or something like that. Consider that Bitcoin ETFs are surpassing 50% size of ETFs of gold. And they just started. We told you that Bitcoin is better than gold in this video. Watch it. If you want to know how crazy went gold when we had the ETF approval, how this can take Bitcoin to $200,000 and the path for that uh, movement that is being uh, so strong in Bitcoin. This was gold, ups and downs, ups and downs. And you can see here, Bitcoin just going up so crazy and not following whatsoever gold action. We are going stronger and stronger you need to consider that Bitcoin is breaking all-time highs in all top 20 fiat currencies. And you can see that we are a little bit uh, to the dollar, euro, and British pound, Swiss franc, etc. But even the Mexican peso, but a lot of cryptocurrencies out there are uh, in all-time highs already. Max telling us, I can't believe this was so simple. This happened again. What? Well, we top. We have a fake out, we have a breakdown, then we bottom, and then we start again the cycle that we had here, and the same was here. Top, fake out, breakdown, bottom, and top again. So we are now searching for our top. And Max believes that first things first, we have to go to $90,000 because of this brothering witch pattern that I like. Why not? We might be this very year in the 90, 100,000K, something like that. But for that, just keep dreaming. But we need Bitcoin to go higher in the daily. Right now, going down after one, two, three, four, five days in a row going up, we uh, went down yesterday. So we'll see about today. And what about Ethereum? Ethereum topped at 3,500, which is awesome, beyond the line of 3,500. But we are going down now. And what about the monthly? Well, we had the fourth best performance in the closer for that candle in Ethereum and the second best February for uh, Ethereum's history. Eight times February has been in the green. Two times it's been in the red. Also consider this line, this support line that I love and we are respecting. So we just need to break the all-time high now. Also, uh, consider that uh, we had a good February, but March can be awesome as we had a 214% rise uh, with Ethereum. This was a record for Ethereum in 2017. So maybe we are doing the same. Do you picture a 200% rise that we bring uh, Ethereum to the $10,000 range? Where do we sign? We are greedy, string greed. And it's no wonder this girl not buying Bitcoin at 50K. She is uh, not even buying Bitcoin at 30K. But see what happens at 100K. She just jumped <laughs> for the Bitcoin. Funny, funny stuff. The market in the green. The bubbles are in the green. And uh, now everybody trying to see if we have the alt season. If Bitcoin consolidates, Jell is telling us here, that altcoins will fly. 
SBF from jail telling inmates and prison guards to buy Solana. Which one are you going to buy? Maybe Link? That's one of my favorite projects. Link will be securing proof of reserves of all Bitcoin ETFs soon. This is what Kyle told us. And we have now news that ARK Invest and 21 shares are enhancing Bitcoin ETF transparency with Chainlink integration. So maybe the next uh, crazy thing in crypto is that now institutions are there buying. They are actually going to tokenize everything. And what are they going to use for safety? Chainlink, in my opinion. We'll see about that. Remember about price. If you just care about price, that we projected the possibility that link goes this bull run to $87. We'll see about that. We'll see it in dextools.io. You have the link in the description below. There you have the hot pairs, Pepe, Trump, Pandora, Dex itself, and so many others. Are you buying Dogecoin? Well, it broke this parabolic line. And we told you everything about Pepe. So maybe now it's time for Dogecoin. We had a prediction that Dogecoin, uh, Elon Musk's favorite, might go to $17. Maybe a little bit of Dogecoin. Or maybe you went to Dextool.io and uh, you bought some Hemule because I told you yesterday, if you did so, it's going up. So crazy stuff. Remember to use coin tracking to track your portfolio. You have the link in the description below. It's the one I use myself. And I also myself, and I also myself use a Trezor as a cold wallet. So uh, you have now it in different colors with a discount for the Model T and Model 1. So you have the link in the description below for both 10% discount with coin tracking, uh, the one I use. And also you have that forever discount on the Model 1 and T in Trezor. Link in the description below. Also to buy Bit, the card that I use, if you want to use a crypto debit card and go up to 25 euros using my link. Thank you very much. And thank you very much to Andy V. Said. He uh, sent me this video, this dog, not a cat, but a dog, with this ability uh, for shooting balloons. I haven't seen this in my life. Maybe this is AI. Is this a reality? What about this cat? He wants to just bite its nails because can't stand the situation of the market right now. So cute, so very cute, this cat. Also here, you can see how sad he is because, uh, again, he can't stand the market conditions. You have to be patient. We'll see what the future brings. Do not be trapped in your FOMO like this cat. Oh, my God. It's not feeling okay. And this one isn't either feeling like all oh, this is a earthquake. Oh, my God. But I want more. Just give me more. Please, please, pretty please. And it has more. What about this guy loving you? I will never be away from you. I will never leave you. Do not leave me, please. What about these two? Again, friends forever here in your channel, Crypto News with Rodrigo Arnedo. Of course, here you find your community. And let me tell you one last thing. Uh, this is about Brave Browser, and they have now Leo also on Android, on your cell phone. So you can use it there. Remember, go to uh, configuration there and type Leo, and you can have Leo already in your browser. And then if you are in a website, I will tell you more about this in AI News, but uh, you can have a sum up of a website or ask questions about a site or whatever you prefer. Also, consider watching AI news where I tell you more and more about this. But if you want to learn more about crypto, then one of these two videos. We are researching already. We'll see if this is the weekend of the all-time high for Bitcoin here in Rodrigo Arnedo's Crypto News, Health, Money, Love, Party in Peace, and the best is yet to come. To the moon!